I thought about giving up many times. But something inside me pushed me forward. When I started in Vancouver, there was a local crew called the Never Never Crew. Khalifa Kush, Shadow Space, Voltra. So they were performing in front of the art gallery, and I saw it and I was kind of blown away. I thought, oh, this looks super cool. I want to give it a try. Uh, um, and that was kind of my introduction to the dance. So I'm definitely excited to hopefully go to the Olympics and also um, the Pan Am Games as well. It should be a lot of fun. Um, but at the same time, my kind of mentality with breaking with any event that I go to is I just kind of take it with a grain of salt. I'm going to have the best time that I can. I'm going to do the best that I can. Um, my motto has always been the same, it, which is like stay ready so I don't have to get ready. I would say I'm more focused now um, and there's a lot more like physical conditioning. Um, but at the same time, I for any event, I never wanted to change the way that I dance. I never want to change the way that I approach it. I think I've made it this far being myself, being authentically myself and kind of representing myself on the stage. So that's what I'm going to keep doing um, and hopefully um, continue to to successfully do that, but we'll see. Keep swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. There are so many characters. It's like watching a superhero movie. Like it's like trying to compare Batman and Superman. They're very different, you know. And maybe one day Superman will win. Maybe one day Batman will win. But they approach uh, uh, the the way they approach um, whatever they do is super different. But they're equally as powerful. And I'm looking forward to more people seeing it. What am I chasing now? The Team Canada dream. That's kind of the biggest thing and the biggest opportunity that comes from something like the Olympics. It's a platform that we normally would not have access to. And so it's people that normally would not see breaking. And that's the most exciting thing for me, um, for people to see it and fall in love with it, like I said, um, because um, when I was a kid, this was what I fell in love with. This was everything to me. And, and I hope to see that spark in other people as well.